you on how to create window with mock two. You know, Akitar has its own window rules, but I want to teach you how you can modify your own window rules. You can create any window rules of your choice. The first thing to do is to zoom the area of the window. To zoom the window area. Then you select wall two because this wall is already black. We have to differentiate the line two and the wall. So we are choosing purple. Our window hood will be four, five inches. Five inches. Let's press it. Here will be five inches again. And two inches. The next thing is to give the window hood a design. And this is how you do it. Just look at what I'm doing. Don't speak, don't skip any part of this video so you won't make a mistake. And if you like what you are watching, do subscribe to my YouTube channel. Turn on the notification button so anytime I post a new video, you'll be notified. Like and share this video and comment so I know your view about the video. Shorten the lines. You can leave it like this, but I want to give this window hood some curves. Then you choose this this um a this segment using tangent. Give it a little curve. Leave it like this. Then the next thing is to select your mock tool, hold space button, and click enter. Then you notice that the area of this line we created has changed. It means we have inserted more inside this. Now the next thing to do is duplicate this thing we did by holding Control Shift D. Control Shift Control Shift D Then You drag it here Reason is because You know the wee Windows are not always the same size Like the size of the Window for room and toilet is not the same measurement If you Create this After creating this small you need to create another one for that um, smaller windows. If you don't do, if you don't duplicate it, it will be very difficult for you to create a window to create for those small ones. So when you duplicate it, the next thing for you to do is go to your 3D. Go to your 3D. This is a room and parlor bungalow, two flat. It's a very simple design. Our window hood will be located right at this spot. This spot. Now, let's zoom. As you can see, this is the morph. Now, select it and bring it up here. From this level, 
to this place is 3 inches. I'm marking with 8 inches. Now you come here. You come here and change it to 3 feet. As you can see, the mop tool is now at the very bottom of the window. You zoom again so you see what you are doing. Select this end. Now choose two. Do it. Click this end. You take it off. Click OK. Click OK. Then you bring to this point. Click OK. Bring it down. Click OK. Then you close. And this is it. This is it. Now, you have to select this particular window hood and fix it in every place you want to fix it. All the windows that have the same size, you have to select it and fix it there. For those windows that are smaller, use that one with duplicated them. Use it for that place. Do exactly the same thing I did here. Exactly the same thing I did in that um, 3D do it for you to get that result I got there. Now for you to fix all the windows or this uh, window hood in all the windows you have to reduce the size. You zoom out. Now select and paste. If paste needs anywhere you need to rotate you rotate it and paste it all around. If you like what you just watch just give me this video a thumb up and comment comment in my um, comment section for me to know what you review about this video. Thank you very much.